I feel like this is almost too easy. <laughs> can can detangling be too easy? Like, is someone playing a trick on me? Because Hello Kellys, it's Mary and welcome back to the Kylie Closet. If this is your first time visiting my channel, then welcome. If you're returning to my channel, then welcome back. Uh, today's video is going to be me testing out another comb. It literally cost me three pounds from Asda, which is essentially like buying a five dollar comb from Walmart. So it comes in this packaging right here, but obviously I've taken it out of the packaging. This is the Big Hair Tools Large Wide Tooth Comb and it says Tame, Thick and Curly Hair. It says 30% stronger, 30% longer wavy teeth and it says extra large size comb, extra strong wavy teeth, extra long. And on the back it just says wavy teeth shape reduces knots, two levels of teeth aids detangling. So you can see the logo for Big Hair Tools here. And then we have the white teeth comb. As you can see, these are the wavy teeth. You have very big, thicker ones on the ends. And then you have alternating longer and slightly shorter bristles in the middle. So to give you a comparison between this white tooth comb and a your average white tooth comb, these are the sizes of both. So you can see these are I would say they're pretty much the same size. If I hold them back to back, you can see they're not that different in size or really in the spacing of the teeth. They both have 13 teeth. It does say extra large size comb, but is it that much bigger than a white teeth comb? Not really. So I'm going to be trying this out today on my hair. My hair has deep conditioner in it, so I'm going to be using this to detangle before I wash my deep conditioner out. So we're gonna see how well this performs on my type for natural hair. Before starting, let me just say, I have a whole playlist of brush and comb reviews on my type for hair up here. So you can click the link if you want to watch any of those videos after this video is finished, of course. Thank you for watching. I also review hair products and I just have fun with my natural hair. So if you would like to see more videos like this one, then please hit the red subscribe button below. You can also hit the bell for notifications. That way you'll get notified every time I upload a new video. Right, let's get into it. Okay. That feels nice. That feels very nice actually. It has an interesting sound to it. Okay, I'm just I'm just doing this for fun now. Like this is already detangled. This is nice. Very simple, very easy. For this section, I've only lost a little bit of hair, like that much. Just to add, my hair has not been detangled previously either. So, is this hollow inside? Because it has a sound like it's not solid all the way through. It sounds a bit hollow, but it's fine. Okay, so let's go on to the next section. Oh, okay. I've got a bit more resistance. Um, I did not finger detangle or comb detangle my hair at all during this whole process of washing my hair. So I am aware that I do have some tangles, especially towards the roots. Currently, though, this feels very, very easy. into the roots. No, it's fine. Feels nice. Okay. This is how much hair came out. I do need to get rid of some shed hairs for sure, so that's fine. This is shedding for me. I feel like this is almost too easy. <laughs> can can detangling be too easy? Like, is someone playing a trick on me? Because Oh, hold on. I've got a couple of tangles still in here. Hold on. Do I then? Hold on. Let's check this. A tiny bit, but not a lot. That was literally like one tangle. That was surprisingly easy. I'm trying to figure out if this is, is it supposed to, is it better than my, my, my tooth comb at this point? Maybe there is something to this wavy, the wavy teeth. I don't know. Okay, I 
can feel more oh, I can feel more pulling towards the roots for sure. Okay. Let's go with the next section. Ryan Little. <laughs> okay, yeah, so we're definitely hitting some tangles. But it's not doing a bad job at all. Well, that was lovely, very nice, very easy. Um, you do have to pay a little bit more attention in the roots, but that's like with any comb or brush. It goes through my roots nicely. So far, I'm very happy. It does not feel like it's snagging anywhere. It seems to make pretty light work of tangles. So, I mean, I'm quite happy so far. I'm kind of surprised. I don't really know why I'm so surprised. Like, what did I expect? It's a wide tooth comb. I'm kind of curious to know, like, is this really that much better than a wide tooth comb? So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be trying, yes, I tried it out a little already. I'm going to be trying the next section out with my actual wide tooth comb here. Just for the comparison, because it feels easier to me than, a white, than my regular white tooth comb. But, yeah. <laughs> I'm a bit confused because I just feel like, wow, it feels very, very easy. And I'm like, does my white tooth comb, my regular white tooth comb feel like this? So, let's have a look. Alright, so, so far that was fine, and then we hit here, and we have a whole snag right here. So I'm going to try to go through that slowly. Okay. I do know the roots of... Whoa, ho, 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 the roots of my hair are not happy. <laughs> okay. They really do need decent detangling. Hold on. Oh, wow, okay. See if I can work that in my fingers because I don't, oh, wow, wow, okay. I don't usually try to work those kind of snags out with a comb. I think they should be gone now though. Let's see. felt nice like this it feels sturdy it doesn't have that hollow feeling but it's still light and took out a decent amount of hair with this comb <laughs> didn't have a massive snag in it like that one but one thing I do notice I feel like this comb pulls on my roots more than this one and I think it's maybe to do with the wavy teeth because these are straight they just go straight through but I feel like because these are wavy they kind of pick up on your kinks and curls a bit more so I feel like it pulls more towards the roots of my hair which means Technically, I suppose this might be better for getting shed hair out. Who knows? But 
it seems to be doing a pretty thorough job i'm going to carry on with this comb and just see what how the rest of this pans out and then i'll be bringing you my final verdict at the end okay loves so all done in summary uh this is how much hair was lost i had quite a lot of tangling in my roots here we go this is all the shedding and everything it's been a little while since i really combed through my hair like that so yeah this is like this is not a big deal for me this is like average for me and plus when i've got quite a lot of tangles yeah <laughs> so final verdict on this comb it's all right my other regular white tooth comb is just i feel like it's easier to get through my hair with that the the bristles the coat the co the teeth that's what i'm looking for the teeth are straight because these teeth are wavy it actually grabs onto more hair which means in a way it is more effective at detangling but i feel like it does pull at the roots a little bit more um if you're tender headed i don't know if you should go for this because i feel like it doesn't hurt necessarily because i'm quite gentle with my hair but i could definitely feel the difference so if you're tender headed i think just go for your regular white tooth comb you'll be better off but if you want to try something and you know you need a really really thorough detangling and you really want it to get through your hair and really get through to the roots properly i'm gonna say that you should try this definitely um would i use this again yeah i would if my hair was really tangled and i felt like i really needed a really thorough comb through i'd say yes i like the grip of it it fits into my hands easily it's lightweight it feels nice i still i have to get used to that kind of weird hollow sound i don't know something about the plasticky sound is strange to me but it's okay like i can live with it if i need something to detangle with and it's nearby i'll definitely grab it again and use it i kind of do prefer my other white teeth comb though low-key i kind of do so that's it in the comment section below let me know have you come across this big hair tools extra large comb before if you have and you've tried it, let me know in the comments section below what you thought about it, if you liked it, if you didn't like it and for what reasons. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, then please share this video with a friend. As always, you can catch me again on my channel, The Kelly Closet. So if you'd like to see more videos like this one, especially comb and brush reviews, then hit the red subscribe button below. You can also hit the bell for notifications. Wishing you health, happiness and beautiful hair. I'll see you again soon. Take care.